Hey everybody, it's me, 24th Century Nintendo Gamer. And if you watched the last episode, this isn't where we left off. You know what the last one we were at? Well, I sort of walked through it before I recorded, so... Just pretend I went through the door. This is what we want turned out to be. Let's see what's at the top, will it, shall we? I mean, it's not like there's gonna be someone following us. That, that's just, that's just crazy talk, you know? Let's just get out here and see what we'll, Whoa, whoa! Huh? Where'd he come from? I'm scared, I'm scared! <laughs> I own a happy mask shop. I travel far and wide in search of masks. Though in my travels, a very important mask was stolen from me from an imp in the woods. So who I am at a loss. And now I found you. Now don't take me rude, because I totally am, but I have been following you. Hey! For I know of a way to return you to your former self. If you can get back the precious item, precious item, I don't know what it's talking about. Is it talking about Epona? That, that makes sense. But how can we turn me to normal with Epona? Hmm, mysteries. In exchange, all I ask is that you also get back my precious mask that the imp store for me. What? Is it not a simple task? Why is someone like you, it should be by no means a difficult task. Except, the one thing is, I'm a biz very busy fellow, and I must leave this place in three days. How grateful I would be if you could bring it back to me before my time is up. <laughs> but yes, you'll be fine. I see you are young and have tremendous courage. I'm sure you'll find it right away. Well then, I am counting on you. Well, you hold up. We gotta get back to mass. We can be back to normal. Let's go. South Clock Town. Ah, Majora's Mask. Time to start our adventure. And let's face it, the last video was basically just the introduction. He gives me the creeps. That mask salesman was the... Sorry, just thinking out loud. For three days, and if we never sleep, that just leaves us with a measly 72 hours. Talk about demanding. Well, don't just stand there. We're going to see the Great Fairy. Look, you want to find the school kid, don't you? The great fairy would know what he's up to. She watches over everything. And it's between you and me. Skull Kid is no match for the great fairy. Go to the shrine near the north gate. You'll find the great fairy in there. Well, since we obviously know where north gate is, let's... What the... What was that? It's a dog! Let's get him! Oh, uh -oh. I didn't know the dog can fall in the water. Huh. Well... But look at this, I'm doing ballet! I forgot to mention that last time. You're doing ballet! Ballet! You know, it's kind of funny how ballet is spelled. It always looks like... When I was young, I thought that, that's how you spelled ballot. I don't know what ballot is, but apparently ballot's a word. So right now, it's boom in the dictionary. Boom! Ballot! But... Anyway, we need to get a map. Because everyone needs a map of a town. Everyone does. I mean, who doesn't need a map? I mean, who doesn't need a map? Everyone needs a map. What's this? Green clothes? White fairy? So, could you get a chance to be a forest fairy? Oh my! My name is Tinkle. I think I'm the same as you, so a forest fairy. Alas, though, I'm already age 35. No fairies come to me yet. My father tells me to go up and act my age, but why? I tell you, Tinkle is the very reincarnation of a fairy. Now I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own. I sell maps to help out my father. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky. I have a fairy I know, I know. We should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange, I will sell you a map. Or cheap, as a sign of my friendship. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Yippee! You got a map of Clock Town. Yay! Tingle, Tingle, Kaloo, Limpa. A little trivia for you, Kulu Limpa is Japanese for basically cuckoo. You know, like the cuckoo sign where you twist the finger, the index finger around someone's, around your ear, you know, like cuckoo, cuckoo. Yeah, that's what Kulu Limpa is basically. So basically, the game's saying he's nuts. Wait, what's this? Why are to the great fairy? Young one, please heal my plea. I have been broken and shattered to pieces by the masked school kid. Please find the one stray fairy lost in town and bring her to this fairy fountain. 
you know, if it's in white, that means it's important, so. I mean, if it's in white, then it's gotta be important. Like, the one you already found, they're important. They're, they're must be important. It's in white, you know? But, I'm a little thing about the map I didn't show you about. Um, that right there is the map, you know, where Deku is placing up. You can turn it on and off. I always leave it on just so you know where you're at. The thing below Deku, Deku Link is actually the time. This game, if you didn't know, it actually tells you how long until the end of something. That I'm not going to tell you about because I don't want to spoil it, even though I probably, you'll probably see in this episode. And I didn't mean to go that way. <laughs> I'm just talking. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> um, yeah. Time is an important part of Majora's Mask. You use it to get places at the right time. It tells you how long you have. Basically everything a lock does, except it's time. Now, me ranting about Majora's Mask mechanics, um, folks, look at this dog. Come on, attack me, come on. Nah, anyway, let's find the straight fairy. We gotta bring it to bring it to straight fairies. It's those owing thingies, you know, the doohickies. You know, the things you saw. I do. There it is. Save me! Please show my plea. I've already read that. I, I, no, I already hold you. Oh, in this box right here? No, no, not that. This box right here. There will always be five rupees in it. So, an easy way to do it is just exit this area, re enter, break the box. Exit this area, re enter, break the box. Easy way to get fast money, just like, like that. But, yeah. Um, another important thing. Um, at West Clock Town. Come on, show the sign. Put the post. Yeah, West Clock Town. Yeah. You will find this person. Ha! Ha! Well, hey there, little guy. Won't you deposit some rupees? Nowadays, even if people have money, they won't deposit any. Nothing! Nothing! So, for a limited time, I'll give you a special gift based on how much you deposit. For example, if you deposit 200 rupees, you'll get an item that holds a lot of rupees. So, what'll it be? Deposit rupees. Alright. By the way, I'm probably in the series called Rupees Whoops. It, I, I just, it's a habit. Whoopies and whoops are the same thing. So if I ever happen to say I got a hundred whoops, just pretend I said a hundred whoopies. I don't know why I keep calling that when I was young. I kept like, I don't know, by young, I mean three years ago, I always called them whoops. So, just pretend that. <laughs> hmm, 21 CNG. Yeah, that's a name. That's a real name, of course. 21 CNG. It's a name as of right now. But, yeah. Pa basically, this guy will give you a uh, extra, uh, extra wallet, bigger one, when you get 200 rupees deposited. And when you get 5,000 rupees. Sounds in unimaginably po impossible, but it, it doesn't really do it. I've done it before. Um, you will get a piece of heart. Which, if you know Zelda, you need four pieces of hearts for one heart container. So, anyway, we got that straight fairy. Let's let's go to the great fairy. You know, maybe something big will happen. Maybe maybe nothing will happen. There's only one way to find out. Paddle, and you, young one of the altered shape, thank you for returning my broken and shadow body to normal. I am the Great Fairy of Magic. You know, I just want to say, this person, the Great Fairy in Oki of Time with Joel's Mask, man, how creepy! I mean, it's basically a naked woman with crazy hair covered in vines. Think about it. I mean, this is, this is... Weighted E for everyone. I don't think this is what should be weighted E. This should be for M. I mean, seriously. Think about it. A naked woman wearing vines. Ugh. Just, ugh.
you've been granted magic power. In your coin form, you can make bubbles. Yeah. The man who lives in the observatory outside town may know the school kid's whereabouts, but be careful. You may not. You m not may. That that's a must. That's not may. That's must. Uh, if you ever we told you for mistake, come see me. Yeah. Anyway, let me show you what you can do with the magic power. As of right now, there's only one thing you can do with it, but later you can do a lot more things. Basically, in this game, you can sh with the deck you scrub, you can shoot bubbles. Do it. You can shoot bubbles. Pop Tingles balloon. Make them fall. You can also pop this Majora's mask balloon. See? Whoa! That's thought of that kid. Maybe we'll talk to him in the next video. Because this video's over. Bye bye!